Hi, welcome to our channel Shaha Computer Education Center. In this tutorial, we will learn how to extract time from date and timestamp with the help of VBA. So first, let's see how it works. So select multiple date and timestamp and click on extract time. You can see the time has been extracted from the date timestamp. So now we will understand how this VV code exactly works. So to write the code, first we have to open the Visual Basic application. So press Alt F11 and go to insert then module. And here we have to type the subroutine for extracting the time. So type sub extract time and first we have to declare two variables that is rmg as a range comma dt as double now we have to create a loop for the selection so type for each rmg in selection type your next rmg within this loop we will check whether the range contains the date or not. So type if is date bracket open rng equal to true then close there end if and within the end if we will type with rng and we are end with and within this we will type here we have to give another line dt equal to int bracket open rng so this line will convert the date into a whole number actually when we get a date and timestamp the actual number is in decimal so we convert it into an integer so that we get a whole number and we will subtract this whole number from the return time. Now here we'll type dot value equal to rng dot value minus dt. Then we will format this value so dot number format equal to within quotation h h M M S S then A M oblique P M quotation close. So this is the code the help of which we can extract time from the date timestamp. So let's go to Excel and here we will assign the macro with this button. So right click assign macro select this extract time macro and click OK. Now select multiple cells and click extract time. Okay, here we have some problem. Statement invalid out of okay. Okay, so here I skipped here. Bing. Okay. Now if I press here, you can see this is converted to time. Now again select this one, click extract time. The time has been extracted. So in this way, you can extract times from the date and timestamp. So I hope you have understood this tutorial very well but still if you have any problem regarding this tutorial you can write me in the comment section. I will surely reply to your queries. If you like this video please hit the like button and share it with your friends and do not forget to subscribe our channel to support us. Thanks for watching the video till the end. See you soon in the next tutorial.